What's up guys, it's Dr. GTA coming through the tutorial today on how to get a script hook V working online, making an online bypass in less than a minute. So hit like and subscribe if you want to see that and this is going to help you. You can also use this for future updates when the DLC is released. Just wait and go to this website, which is uh, DevC. I'll put the link in the description. Go to script hook V and look and see when they update this. It'll be like a day or so after each update. You can download the latest version here. Once you download the latest version, you're just going to exit out of that and you're going to go to uh, extract the 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 um the bin file just extract the bin file to your uh desktop and then once you get that and all you need is the script hook v.dll you can leave these two the same they're okay um all we're going to do is edit this file this is the file that's going to be the one that's locked for working online so we're going to unlock it you can download the link in the description for the hex editor and install that and you're going to go ahead and open up the script hook v using the hex editor once you open it it's going to look like this weird very weird go to search you're going to go to replace you're going to type in this number, which is 743848, and you're going to uh, copy and you're going to paste it in the replace, but you're going to change the 74 to a capital E, capital B, and you're going to make sure the text string the data type is a hex value, and you're going to do all, and pretty much you're going to um, do this just replacing the 74 to the EB. You hit OK. You're going to notice it changed one value. That's pretty much how you do it. It's just those two simple little values. That's all you have to do. Now you're done. You hit save and you're done. You can exit out of this and you can go back and you can delete this. This is your backup file. You don't need it. And then take these three files, copy them, go to the root of your GTA 5 folder. Mine's Steam, so it's going to be x86 Steam, Steam apps, common, Grand Theft Auto 5. Go ahead and paste those in here and override anything. And when you go online, it should work online. Um, you can also, if you're confused about where the directory is for a retail version, it's going to be right here, which is local disk C program x86 Rockstar Games, and it's going to be a folder in here like this called. And it's going to be in there, and that's where you'll paste them right there, like that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys. If this helped you in any way, please leave a like and subscribe for more mods, tech tips, daily GTA 5 trolling, and other content. See you later.